All right, so today Today we are having a super ultra fancy Kirby vacuum and my phone slotches again Use the golf clip like this. No, no slouching. Thank you slouch. I said get up. Stand up. Stupid phone. Ugh. Fine. I'm going to handle you with my hands. Gosh. Picky phone. So today we're actually going to put the Kirby vacuum out of its misery. It's finally had enough. I think I need to adjust the height. Fine, I'll plug it in. So that way you can actually watch it run. What just goes by by. Oh, kiss it goodbye. This is the last time you'll ever see it. It's a piece of garbage anyways. I don't I don't know what to do with it. You can't have it either. I'm not paying you so much for shipping. It's not even worth that much anyways. What's wrong with this thing? Go down! Stupid! Oh, you want to play games now? Oh. Stupid tilt latch. Go up. Let's try to see if we can uh, get it to pick this thing up. Because I actually improved it. I improved it. I put a tiny brush in there with a tiny little magnet. I'm not going to show you it. Though, because some of you are going to be complaining about how I tortured it. So let's see if we can pick this up. Access to the back of it. Wow, Kirby vacuum so powerful that it ripped the whole stuff out of it. Wow, I don't believe it. That's not supposed to happen though. Uh. Let's see. I don't know what to do with this. Hmm. I don't know. Stupid. Don't even know what to do with this. Stupid vacuum. So stupid. It's so stupid. I don't even get it. Know what to do. There you go. Turn on. Oh, I broke the Kirby vacuum. Oh, that's too bad. Stupid. 
clear. To get to pick up more of this mess. Just see if we can pick it up whole. I want to ever watch it pick it up whole. Stupid safety. Fine. Just your bag. <laughs> Chopped it right up. Oh, cheap. Look at that. It just chopped it up. Stupid. Uh, trying to see what else there is. What we can have to pick up. Have to pick up the shell. Pick up the headphone shell. <laughs> What? Why is it always? Why is it refusing to pick it up? Fine. Here we go. up stupid 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 that's it I've had enough of this had enough of this thing so had enough of this machine is it just that switch oh Oh, I hit it too hard. Hit it too hard. Huh. Oh, too bad. Oh, I guess, I guess it's done. Oh, stupid. <sighs> Let's see. <sighs> Fan. I have a new fan on the motor for the uh, hand vac that was broken. I haven't put it put back together actually. It's all in here. What? Oh, it came apart. April Fools. 
This thing's still disassembled. I don't have a new fan for it either. Stupid uh, collectors trying to get their fans so that way you can't have it. And so that way they throw it out. Of course, the fan was super cheap too. With the sound of it, it sounded like I broke this fan too. <sighs> Fine. <sighs> Let's see if we can actually get it to work. Oh, oh stupid. Stupid vacuum. There we go. This thing actually doesn't work anymore, though. doesn't work. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's unplugged. April Fools. I don't even know why there's a day that's uh, just for fooling you in April. It's eight, called April Fools because you're supposed to be fooled that it's really April, but it, it's really the 32nd day of March. And April 1st really isn't until the next day. They just put it on the calendar as April 1st, but in reality it's just March 32nd. What a weird name, April Fools. April Fools. Ooh, sounds super fancy and super dumb.